Hi, this is Zach from MightyMy.com, and today I'm going to show you guys how to format and display the day in Visual Basic. So, first thing we're going to do is create a new project by going up to File and then New Project. Go ahead and give your project a name. I'm just going to go ahead and name mine Format Date. Go ahead and click OK after you get that done. So when your blank project loads up, I'm going to be using one control on this, and it's just going to be a button. So it's just going to be an example to show you how it can be used. So go ahead and throw a button onto your form. So there we go. I'm going to go ahead and change the date or the text to get date. And after you have a button onto your form, let's go ahead and double click our button to get to the code. So right below public class form one, we're going to type in dim cur date for current date as date equals date now. So now current date is going to be date now. So below that, let's type in dim string date as string equals current date dot to string. And then this is where we can format our date. So I'm going to go ahead and type in dd mmm yyyy. So it's going to have the date, a space, a month, space, and then the year. So for button one click, I'm going to go ahead and type in a message box code. So message message box string date. And you don't have to use a message box. For whatever you're using, you can just use string date and that will put it wherever you want it at. So I'm going to go ahead and debug it to show you what happens. Okay, so if I hit get date, right there it says 04 space December space 2012, just like right there. So I'm going to change that a little bit to show you how it can be used. Um, oh, I need to stop that. Okay. So I take out the spaces in it, and let me try it again. Get date, and now there's no spaces. So uh, hopefully this can help you with uh, formatting your date. Um, if this video helped you, like this video, subscribe to my channel, and check out the written tutorial on my website in the description of this video. It's going to have all the code there and a writ written tutorial on it. So thanks for watching.